guys, welcome back to my channel. Hey. This is this is Georgia. I'm here with my friend Ella. Hey. And we're gonna be following a Bob Ross tutorial the best we can, and hopefully it looks good. Mm -hmm. But probably not. Okay, <laughs> it's called On a Clear Day, season 14, episode 8. It's very advanced for us. But we're gonna make yeah, it happen. good painter though. Or artist. I'm hers is gonna look so much better. But we just and we'll just show what it looks like at the end, but you can see us like be stressed and stuff. Alright, so we gotta see what colors we need first. Uh, welcome back. I'm glad to see you today. It's a fantastic day here, and I hope it is wherever you're at. I tell you what, let's do this a beautiful little colorful <laughs> painting today, one that it should make you happy. Let's start out and I'll the colors across the screen you that you right? need to paint along with me. While they're doing that, I'll give you what I've done. Right? Nice. I have my standard. And blue. And blue. And blue. And blue. And blue. And blue. What's Persian blue? No. <laughs> There's not a lot. I'm just like. Darky. What do you do? Like two Ooh. I said no more than this shirt. Oh, I don't want to get in. You want to change? <laughs> we'll be right back. <laughs> Hello, we're back. And I put my hair up. Then we change shirts. Jimmy, Jimmy Buffett. Buffett. <laughs> okay. Prussian blue. Prussian. 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 the liquid white. So it's all slick and it's ready to go. So let's get started. Today, Black. I'm going to start out. Stop. Black. Black. This is my favorite color. Ooh, that's a pretty blue. Good lord. <laughs> what is dark sienna? Use the one inch brush with a little bit of just plain old titanium white. Should we we'll the, be right back. Be right back. Reach up here and get a little touch of the lizard <laughs> crimson. So titanium white and lizard crimson. Let's go right up wait, here. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, what's, uh, oh. what's crimson? Like red? Reddish brown. It's like maroon. Alabama. Yeah. Alabama. Alabama. Yeehaw. Bushes. Now the cracker. No. Mm -hmm. Okay. What else do we have? Do we have yellow? I think we have yellow. We hey, what did he what color he put it with like red. Where did I get? There's yellow. Uh -huh. Why is he starting and still with trying just to? Just a little spotted color. color. Just a little touch. There's three different of yellows. Color. If we need a color, we'll just pause it. But we're gonna try not to pause it. What is dark sienna? <laughs> I don't know. Let me tell you what I've done already. Right, I have my standard 18 by 24 inch canvas here. Today, I'm gonna to start out. Use the one inch brush with a little bit of just plain old titanium white. Reach up here and get a little touch of the alizarin crimson. So titanium. What is crimson? Thought today we'd have a little sun up here in the sky. So we started out with just a little spot of color. Just a little touch of color. That's all there is to it. That simple. That simple. I'm going to clean the brush. Shake it off. Oh. <laughs> the devil out of it. Now then, side of this. This is just cadmium yellow and white. Like so. There we go. Well, it looks like an egg I cooked this morning. <laughs> Maybe we'll have a little water down here. And we'll put a little touch of that yellow and white mixture right down in here. Now then, no! I'm going to go right into a little touch of the yellow ochre. And we'll blend a little touch of that oh. right around the edges. <laughs> there we go. Gosh. This is just plain oh! yellow ochre. <laughs> Oh, that's nice. I, I put red on it. All we're looking 
for is a little color. We'll come back and straighten it all up. There's a whole bottle later. Right. Yeah. Oh, we're gonna cheat for a second. I see it. I put red on there. I'm upset. Okay. Okay. I want to add a little touch of Indian y'all to that too. Oh yeah, that's nice. That brightens it up even better. And you can just mm -hmm. put this on any old way that makes you happy. All we're looking for is a little color. We'll come back and straighten it all up and have fun with it later. Right there. Yeah. All we're doing is just mm -hmm. putting in some base colors. Into okay. yellow ochre. Ochre! Right, right. Way! We'll go back up here. Ochre! And add that right around here. Oh, like so. This looks so bad. There, sort of an orangey color. Orange. Oh, As I say, this is just going to be a very bright, happy little painting. It's not really happy. Right there. there. Use little crisscross strokes because that way you have feathered edges. Okay. If you just make a circle around here, it's a son of a gun to blend it out. And we're going to try to blend all this color out. I'm going to take a little bit of brown, a little brown, a little brown. Reach over here, get brown. a little touch, be right back there. It is. He's using black. A little touch of the blue and blue. put it right in the That's brown. That's not so blue. Part it up in here. I want a darker color on the outside edges. So start out here and let it work. Mix it with a liquid white. Okay. We can even put it down in here. Oh! Oh no! This is too hard. I don't like this. It's crying. Oh, Why is it so dark? <laughs> this is brown. Why would you put brown in the sky? No. He's like, we just need some color on there. These colors don't look good. A little touch of the blue and put it right in the brown. So I have Prussian blue oh, I didn't and that. Van Dyke brown. Same old dirty brush. And I'm going to start it up in here. I want a darker color on the outside edges. So start out here and let it work forward. That way we get lighter, lighter, lighter. <laughs> there. What? Already, this is just a fun painting. No. Just a fun painting. A little bit on that. Wash your brush. Smack Wash it off real good. <laughs> Give it a shake. <laughs> and just beat the devil out of it. <laughs> get a very dry yeah. brush. Be sure your brush is dry. If it's wet and you hit all this, you're gonna end up in agony city and you're gonna be upset. Already in agony. Be sure it's good and dry. Mm -hmm. There. And just begin blending. Still make little crisscross strokes. I'm not doing it. Little crisscross strokes. Blend them. I probably should have moved. And you can spend a lot of time. How does it look that good? Oh. What the? I wanna give this to someone. I'm sending it to Bob Ross and be like, see what? Is he? I don't know. <laughs> Is Bob Ross alive? I don't know, honestly. Alright, ready? Yeah. You can spend a lot of time on this blending if you want. And you can make it, uh, it's just, it's unbelievable how smooth you can make it. But always work from the light area out. Don't bring the dirty brush back into the center. Oops. <laughs> now then, I want to put a sun up in here, so I'll just use my finger. And let's go right up in here. Oh. Ooh. Just using the finger, we can just put it in a little circle. See, that's all there is to it. So you can take your knife, come right back knife. up here. Let's look at it. I have so a knife. So take your knife and just go back up. Let's go again. All right, I'm going to spike it. Oh, wait. You see the bottom part, like right there. Okay. This painting makes you feel warm. There. And that's good. As I say, we're having a fantastic day here. It's just, it's just good to be alive sometime. Wash off a brush. <laughs> there we are. Now, if you want to you can put some little clouds out here in the sky. That was a little, a little phthalo blue, a little crimson, a little bit of white. And you put as many or as few as you want in your world. Just want to show you how to do it. Some little floaters down in here. Okay. Now don't use blue in these clouds because there's yellow here in the sky. You use blue in there, and you're gonna have bright green clouds. He said blue. 
Unless you want green clouds. If you want green clouds, then you should have green clouds. <laughs> he said you should. Well, let's go a little mountain. I'm going to take some I'm out Prussian out. blue and out. lizard crimson. Where in your world does your mountain live? Well, he wants a darker. There he is. Maybe there's a bump here. Uh -huh. See? I just let him go. Look that looks so good. And if you live in an area where there's no mountains, I really try to please the majority of people. But if you don't want a mountain in your world, then leave it out. The painting is still complete without a mountain. If you have time, take a take a photograph of the painting you're doing. You're okay, you want to take a picture see how good we got so far? Yeah. Insert picture of Bob's picture. And then this is ours. trees in this too because this one has the trees in it. I think it's okay. Take some white, a little thing of blue, mix it together. Alright, now that we use that for our shadow color. Once again oh, pull it out very flat, blue. cut across, and get our little roll of paint. See there? That little bit of a touch of pink just adds a little warmth to it. Let's have us a happy little evergreen tree. He lives right there. It does now. It does now. This is just a lavender color. There's some reflection down here in the water. There we go. That's supposed to be water. And begin working it back and forth. Now look how that dark shows up against that light background. Oh, Isn't it spectacular? Those are hard to do. <laughs> and if you're out selling your paint. <laughs> That tree looks awful. <laughs> That's not, that looks like a Christmas tree. The tree does not look like a tree. It's not happy. <laughs> it's not a happy tree. How do you do that? I have no idea. Is it black? No, you said it was like lavender. <laughs> <laughs> but that is not lavender. Your tree looks good, <laughs> man. Look at mine. <laughs> oh. I don't know how to fix it either. There's a giant evergreen. Oh, you're a big rascal. I'm not doing another tree. Hmm. Maybe there's some little bushes that live oh, yeah. right out. Oh, look, here's a nice reflection. But we know it's there. So it's We're finishing up. So this is what Bob Ross's looks like. Here, happy painting and God bless. And these are what ours looks like. Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> so this was fun. <laughs> this was really hard. Very hard. Harder than I thought. But and we did it. Yep. It was just a happy little accident. <laughs> like my video and comment which one is better. Bye, pickles. And shout out to Pickle Rick. Bye! <laughs>